Alright, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K21, I've had a week to play the game. What are we at? A week or so, 10 days, 9 days to play the game. We've got more perspective. I know exactly how the game goes now. I know what's strong, what's weak. I also know what's working and what's obsolete. We're going to talk about that in this video. I'm going to give you the best stretch big bill. My mind has been changed and I'm going to tell you why right after this. So make sure you like the video, man. Please like the videos. Let's get this video over a thousand likes in the first 24 hours and I'm going to bring you some incredible stretch big gameplay tomorrow evening. Get the video over a thousand likes, subscribe if you're new, and let's get right into it. Eat up! You make it to C25, that's OG status. I was told you could be anything, just don't be average. Down bad, flat pockets, that shit made me upset. Start hustling non-stop, don't plan on breaking that head. Alright, so, like I said, bro, with a week or so, to put this all in perspective, I've gotten to the point where I realize what's important in this game and what's really not. And bigs are all but obsolete. I'm just not even gonna lie to you. Like, you don't need a big beefy interior big. And I guess that's what a lot of the community was betting on this year. So you can make this bill at power four. If you make the bill, I'm gonna show you the difference between if you make the bill at power four and if you make him at, uh, at uh, center. If you make the bill at power forward, it's really the defensive badge. And I'm gonna show you all three since, since three things can go six nine, right? So if you make this bill at power forward, you're gonna get 10 defensive badges. So convincing the wisdom would probably say make him at power forward. Now, if you make it at small forward, let me show you here, show you how many defensive badges you're gonna get. Cause you're probably gonna end up having to play the three anyway, right? If you're making a small for uh, small four, making a small four, you're going to get nine defensive badges. And if you make him a center, you're gonna get nine defensive badges as well. So, if you want to be like everybody else, make him a power forward. That way, you can put you can put three on box, three on um, intimidator, and three on rebound chaser, and then you can put one on chase down artist. I'm going to be hard-headed. Just I mean, like I, I like for my joint to be a little bit different, man. Like, you ain't going to see no stretch fives this year. I'm going to go stretch five. That way, I can be a little bit different, but at the same time, I can, um, you know, be like everybody else. Because this is a shooting game. If you can't shoot the ball in this game, you just really just, you, it's, it's really no, no point. I'm going for the max badges on this joker, bro. Not even going to lie to you. We're going to bring that post fade down. I'm I'm getting all 30 badges. I'm not even gonna lie. I don't see a point. I don't see any point in not getting all 30 of those badges. You're gonna get nine defensive badges, like I said. I wish I could get 10, but hey, I'm a center. I'm just like a defensive badge in and of myself. The rest of it, we're gonna do it just like this. Put shot close, 80, uh driving dunk, and can we put standing dunk up like that? That's what we're gonna do right there. Hey, look, man, I'm gonna tell you what, do this right here. Boom. I'm going to tell you why I'm putting driving layup at 40. To be honest, you don't even need driving layup at all. I consistently make contested layups because I use the shot stick. It's just the fact of using the shot stick and picking your spots here and there. I just made him like this just because you know I wanted, I, I made him like this because I wanted to be able to do some stuff um you know and, and you can't get you it's like they don't let you get any finishing badges like i guess you could you know what you could put this down and and get some but you still gotta have your standing dunk up and um what what my post hook i guess like and then i could get like five badges but then you don't get no driving dunk or something like that so i mean you got this but then you can't shoot the ball so like like i wouldn't even i wouldn't even think about doing that look it's cool it's cool to to put this up and maybe you can put this down and you can put this up and bro you can't it's, it's just like they're not gonna give you no finishing badges unless you unless you feel this guy out right here you're not you're not getting any finishing badges like they just ain't giving them to you so with that being the case you're a stretch anyway you're supposed to be on the perimeter you shouldn't even be thinking about it 
Look, I promise you, I promise you that this right here is enough. You'll be able to do some stuff. You're going to be able to dunk the basketball. I don't know why they let you dunk the basketball with a 48 or whatever, but you're 6'9". You're 6'9", bro. You should be able to dunk the basketball. We always go to five, and I already told you what we're going to use for our um, for our height. We're going to go 6'9". Um, you can go 6'10". I was talking to Black Hokage on Twitter. He said he went 6'10", and then he brought the arms in a couple. I'm going to go 6'9", just because this is what I've been successful with on the uh, PlayStation, and we're going to lead the speed at like 62 but um this is what we're gonna do with this we're gonna bring this up uh we're gonna we want his weight we want his strength to be 75 right and uh that's all you need like you could make the strength you can make the speed be 60 and the strength be 70 that's perfectly fine no problem at all i just want the little extra uh off against against the guys on the inside or what have you. So that's why I'm going with the 75. So that way when I get up to 98, 99, I have 75 interior and I'll be good. But you could leave it at even and have 60 perimeter. But bro, it just seems like this year, like it's just no, there is no difference between a whole lot of stuff. So this is where we're gonna go. We're gonna go 274 on it. Uh, wingspan, we're gonna leave it the same because I don't wanna lose any three ball at all. Now you could match the wingspan out have an 81 three ball, and then you can get glass tape because you got 80 defensive rebound because you got to have 80 defensive rebounding to get glass tape. So if you want to do that, go ahead and do it. But me, I'm just going to keep it like this. I'm just going to keep it raw just like this with a with a barely a 60 driving dunk, all that stuff like that. This is what we're going to do. And uh, we're going to take glass tape because we want to be, we want to be, very incognito with all of this. We don't want people to know who we are. And then you get a stretch five. And they're gonna see you be a stretch five, bro. And they still not gonna guard you. And then, you know, we're gonna go over here to test bill. And uh, I'm gonna show you, I'm just gonna show you one thing here. And I shoot with the shot stick, so that's why 85 is gonna be good enough for me. I'm gonna be spraying that joint, man. So these are the badges that I would suggest that you use with him. If you got one badge, bro, I I'm gonna always say put it on slithery. Like, that, that's it. You got one badge. You got one badge here. Put it on bailout. 30 badges over there. And we already talked about this. Uh, that. You're going to go Intimidator. We're going to go Intimidator. And uh, Rebound Chaser. Where you at? Rebound. And Rebound Chaser. That's what we're going to do. Boom. Those are going to be the badges. Your defensive badges. Because you got to be able to box out. If you feel like you can box out enough, that's cool. Uh, we going Hall of Fame. We can go crazy with the Hall of Fames here, man. We can go crazy with the Hall of Fames. All right, you can just go crazy with the Hall of Fame. Still got ten badges left. Put put that on Green Machine. You understand what I'm saying? You got you got so many badges left. You can just put anything on that you want. Shoot, they say flexible release, and and you put like clutch shooter on Hall of Fame, or you can. You don't even need flexible release. You can take this off. And put a hot start on silver. Something like that, bro. You can do anything you want. Take clutch shooter off. Put pick and popper on. You know what I'm saying? Put both of these on gold. You can do so many things. You're not even going to need flexible release or anything like that. With uh, with uh, that. And you, hey, maybe you can put on volume shooter. But with this three ball, bro, you're not going You're not gonna need it. 85 appears to be the number. I see my boy Gambit just out there just spraying. <laughs> Uh, he ain't missing. He's shooting like 90%. He had a perimeter lock. Put the perimeter lock up when he got his 6-7 stretch four. Boom. So like I said, you can go, you can go 6-4. I mean you can go 6-7. I mean not 6-7. You can go power forward or center on this. If you want that extra defensive bad, see what I would do is this. And then if I had the extra defensive bad, I put chase down, chase down artist. But I haven't seen a whole lot of chase downs this year or or really anything, man. And like the interior defense is so so strong right now that it don't even matter like it really doesn't matter what you do man like you could literally just just it don't matter who down there we got six seven point guards down there playing defense so it is what it is anyway that's all we got for y'all today man in this video hopefully you guys enjoyed it leave a like on the video and if you think it's trash go ahead and subscribe this is what i want you to do subscribe to the channel Subscribe for more daily 2K content, and I promise you, tomorrow evening, I'm going to have this dude 
relatively maxed out. And uh, when I get him maxed out, you know, y'all gonna just see, like, he's not even gonna be maxed out. I have him to 85 or something like that tomorrow. And uh, when we get him to that 85, y'all gonna see, man, this dude is broke, man. Like, like if you can shoot the basketball, the interior defense being so OP, you really don't even need a beefy big man in the, in the inside, like I said. So get a build a try, man. Sorry about the last build that we said. We thought the game was going to be like it was last year, but big men are obsolete. So if you can't shoot them, if you're not a shooting big, you ain't nothing. So that's what we're going with. And y'all going to see proof of that tomorrow. Anyway, I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Speak. Then commence. It don't make cash and it don't make sense. Cause we can't pay rent with no one's opinion. So in that sense, I never value your two cents. Hey, darn. Please leave that bullshit you speak at the barn. Cause I ain't buying. I'm only 5'8, that's fine, nigga. I can give a heart transplant to a giant. I ain't lying, Godspeed. Godspeed, Godspeed. We good.